Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Riley Foster, Foster's Custom Steel in the mountains. Another toaster, as I had said before. They've had drought up here also. Not much rain. The grass is dying and just cooked. Can't do much with it. I'm glad, you know, it kind of saves me some money because I hire a guy to cut the grass. Beautiful sky. Glad there's some overcast because, man, it is smoking hot. But you can look, my camera is aimed 45 degree up. <laughs> there's a tree line, so, yeah. It, we're deep in the mountains, up at the homestead. I did a, early, a video earlier on the church, clearing out around it real good, but I had to do something with the deck. I've been working on it, and I didn't want, this, I didn't want to lose this deck because it just... Well, it costs a lot of money, and that going lumber as it is, it's pulp wood practically. So what I did came up this week end for actually a day. I put this piece of hand railing in right here. It's a five foot run down the ramp, and poured some concrete right there so that water will get away from that real quick. And you've seen the silhouettes of the coal miners. My dad was a coal miner, and my brother Mike Foster was a coal miner. I try to give thanks to those two guys. Spectacular men. And this is kind of a tribute to them, and, and well, all coal miners, but they were. And my dad mined all of his life as, from World War II on till he retired. And I was trained to be a welder in the coal mines, but I ran. I couldn't do it. I did not want to go underground. At that time, I was young and didn't know, but... I was fortunate that I got out and uh, now I'm back and the house is mine and I'm working on it. But I finished up, I stained the deck, kind of a funky stain. Works out really good. It's not quite dry all the way yet, but again, I did all my jigsaw puzzle pieces. I can step on like stepping stones right now. Check it out. Yeah, so I got all these done. Even put some on the side railing and a top railing just random yeah you know, popping them in in different places look like someone strode them across the floor but one of the things i did i guess it's been 30 plus years ago i put in a back door and it was a solid door big hard hinges hardware hinges and stuff it weighed so much and it was just I mean, very heavy, and this did not lighten it up, but I had this window frame for probably 20 plus years in my shop. I was going to put it, I was going to put it on my shop door, but it just didn't work out. It wouldn't fit, and uh, there was already an opening there. So I saved it, and come to find out, this was a good place for it. I had to have something because when you went into the back porch, it was really dark in here. And now, not only does that let light in, you can see out really nice and easy. And it also, uh, it gives you light on the shelving behind the door before it was just pitch black back there. You about had to have a flashlight. So it had several purposes. So I finally got the deck where I'm considering it is finished. I may or may not, I'm going to do the top of the rail, coat it, but oh, I do not want to do all those balusters and all this wood. It may wind up I have to, but I don't particularly want to. The railing come out good, nice and strong. That way it gives someone a good handhold coming up. It's not a steep ramp, but here in West Virginia, everything's vertical. <laughs> it's, I mean, as you can see, that's probably a, 15% grade just on the road. So uh, it's the deck is done now. And as far as I'm concerned, we're going to have a reunion here in two weeks. Hopefully a bunch of the family is going to come in and visit. But there's the church. You can see it now. You, well, in a couple of videos, you couldn't even see the church. There was no identification. There was even a roof out there. So again, hopefully those guys are going to knock that out. I'm going to have this shed moved. It can go up on Maria's property. And then we're going to clean all that brush, trees, and mess out of there. 
in the years to come. And I mean, a lot of it's going to get done this fall. It'll be a beautiful view of that mountain. Yeah, but you can't see it for the shrub, vines, hedges, and trees. So anyway, there's a little video on the deck update. And it is nice to be able to get that finished. And I started out putting these puzzle pieces on because the dead gone wood was separating. So I thought, well, you can't just do two or three. So I think there's about 30 or so scattered jigsaw puzzle pieces. So if you guys would reach down there, hey, let me know where you're from. If you're commenting on this and if you already have, I don't care if you do it again. Um, love to know where everybody's from. Don't need your address. <laughs> just country, state, whatever. Give me a thumbs up and share these videos that you've never seen that before. Jigsaw puzzle on the deck. Remember to give thanks and have a great day.